For years. They leave us in prison for years. Uncharged. Uncharged. Because we are Muslims. Because we are Muslims. Where is the world to save us from torture? Where is the world to save us from torture? 
Where is the world to save us from fire? Where is the world to save us from fire? And sadness. And sadness. Where is the world to save the hunger strikers? Where is the world to save the hunger strikers? But we are content. We are content. On the side of justice. On the side of justice. And right. And right. Worshiping the Almighty. Worshiping the Almighty. And our motto on this island is Salam. And our motto on this island is Salam. I'm now going to read. I'm now going to read from Victoria Britain's new book. Victoria Britain's new book. Shadow Lives. Shadow Lives. The Forgotten Women. The Forgotten Women. Of the war on terror. Of the war on terror. She writes in the first two chapters. She writes in the first two chapters about two women. About two women who are wives of men in Guantanamo. Who are wives of men in Guantanamo. One of them was released finally. One of them was released finally in 2007. In 2007. His name is Jamil, and his wife is Saba. I'm going to read about another woman. I'm going to read about another woman. Zanira. The wife of Shakir Amar. The wife of Shakir Amar. She received, in a ne yet another milestone, a devastating letter from her husband. She received, in another milestone, a devastating letter from her husband. This is what he said. This is what he said. I am dying here every day. I am dying here every day. Mentally and physically. Mentally and physically. This is happening to all of us. This is happening to all of us. We have been ignored. We have we been, been ignored. ignored. Locked up in the middle of the ocean for years. Locked up in the middle of the ocean for years. Rather than humiliate myself. Rather than humiliate myself. Having to beg for water. Having to beg for water. I would rather hurry up the process. I would rather hurry up the process. I would like to die quietly. I would like to die quietly. By myself. By myself. I was once 250 pounds. I was once 250 pounds. I dropped to 150 pounds in the first hunger strike. I dropped to 150 pounds in the first hunger strike. I want to make it easy on everyone. I want to make it easy on everyone. I want no feeding, no forced tubes. No help. I want no feeding, no forced tubes, no help. This is my legal right. This is my legal right. The British government refuses to help me. The British government refuses to help me. What is the point of my wife being British? What is the point of my wife being British? I thought Britain stood for justice. I thought Britain stood for justice. But they abandoned us. But they abandoned us. People who have lived in Britain for years. People who have lived in Britain for years. And who have British wives and children. And who have British wives and children. I hold the British government responsible for my death. I hold the British government responsible for my death. As I do the Americans. As I do the Americans. It's hard to paraphrase a chapter. It's hard to paraphrase a chapter. Written about this woman, Zanira. I will swallow. Who has four children? Who has four children? Lives alone. Lives alone. And suffers. And suffers mentally. Mentally. In the absence of her beloved husband. In the absence of her beloved husband. Ten years 
after Shocker arrived in Guantanamo. Ten years after Shocker arrived in Guantanamo. It was his youngest child's 10th birthday. It was, it was his youngest child's 10th birthday. And Valentine's Day in 2012. And Valentine's Day in 2012. In a superhuman effort, in a superhuman effort, to keep her mind focused away from Guantanamo, to keep her mind focused away from Guantanamo, and images of her husband alone in this cell, this and images of her husband alone in this cell, this, in this cage. Zanira wrote the first poem she had written for years. A touching, hopeful love poem. Months later, she was back in her mother's care. Months later, she was back in her mother's care. Persecuted by the voices and painful fantasies. Persecuted by the voices and painful fantasies. A heart of gold. A heart of gold. For my beloved Shakar Amar. For my beloved Shakar Amar. In ten years of waiting. In ten years of waiting. You cared for me and were. You cared for me and were even. You cared for me and you were even ever on my side. Ever on my side. When I needed a favor. When I needed a favor. I cannot forget you. I cannot forget you. No, never. No, never. Time is new. Time is new. And your memory's old. And your memory's old. Because you have a heart of gold. Because you have a heart of gold. You made my now, dreams come true. Manner. You made my dreams come true. Okay. In my hardship helped me through. In my hardship helped me through. Without you, what I would do. Without you, what I would do. Your insistence cannot be sold. Your insistence cannot be sold. Because you have a heart of gold. Because you have a heart of gold. You are the roof over my head. You are the roof over my head. You are the shadow that can't be led. You are the shadow that can't be led. You are my voice when the silence breaks. You are my voice when the silence breaks. Your hand I seek. Your hand I seek. Your hand I hold. Your hand I hold. Because you have a heart of gold. Because you have a heart of gold. Because you have a heart of gold. Because you, you have a heart of gold. Your smile is like a new pearl. Your smile is like a new pearl. Come, I will hide you like a treasure. Come, I will hide you like a treasure. Though now the life is sad and dull. Though now the life is sad and dull. In my heart of sorrow I feel warm. In my heart of sorrow I feel warm. Because you have a heart of gold. Because you have a heart of gold. In your face, in my face, is your reflection. In my face is your reflection. In my mind is your remembrance. In my mind is your remembrance. In my heart is your affection. In my heart is your affection. And the whole world can behold. And the whole world can behold. We love the darkness. We love the darkness. We're after the dark hours of the night. We're after the dark hours of the night. Pride's dawn will come. Pride's dawn will come. Let the world, let the world, with all its bliss, with all its bliss, fade away, fade away. So long as we find favor with God. So long as we find favor with God. A boy may despair. A boy may despair. 
in the face of a problem. In the face of a problem. But we know God has a design. But we know God has a design. Even though the bands tighten. Even though the bands tighten. And seem unbreakable. And seem unbreakable. They will shatter. They will shatter. Those who persist will attain their goal. Those who persist will attain their goal. Those who keep knocking shall gain entry. Those who keep knocking shall gain entry. Oh, crisis intensify. Oh, crisis intensify. The morning is about to break forth. The morning is about to break forth. I can't wait. Thanks. They fight for peace. They fight for peace. Peace, they say. Peace, they say. Peace of mind. Peace of mind. Peace on earth. Peace on earth. Peace of what kind? Peace of what kind? I see them talking. I see them talking. Arguing. Arguing. Fighting. Fighting. What kind of peace are they looking for? What kind of peace are they looking for? Why do they kill? Why do they kill? What are they planning? What are they planning? Is it just talk? Is it just talk? Why do they argue? Why do they argue? Is it so simple to kill? Is it so simple to kill? Is this their plan? Is this their plan? Yes, of course. Yes, of course. They talk. They talk. They argue. They argue. They kill. They kill. They fight for peace. They fight for peace. Should I do your circle? of information to you about that but meanwhile put it in your calendars Cheryl. and the other thing and call our legislators and bring a psychologist with you to see this movie there you go unfortunately not many psychologists have gotten behind this i know bill. that well let's get more of them so uh the and the other thing is there is some talk in, in jim mcgovern's office about Stepping in and finding a way to to find places for the men who have been cleared, um, 
Cindy Buell is not 100% on board, but she's at least listening. Who is Cindy Buell? She's his she's major legislative, legislative Staffer? aide. Staffer? Foreign policy. In, uh, no, this is uh, Jim McGovern's aide. And, uh, He's the right one. And he, is, he would be the best person to do it. Um, she was challenging, but we've had some good emails. So um, if, if we can move at all, I'll let everybody who lives in this district particularly know to get on this. So you, you attracted a lot of attention this morning. Oh. Only one person asked me, why are those people dressed like the <laughs> okay, so so thank you. And, uh, and you can go to the Witness Torture website. There's an ongoing fast. There's a rotating fast to, to join the hunger strikers. And you can also find out what's happening all over the country, where people, particularly on, on Thursday, did a lot. But there'll be ongoing actions to, uh, to address the issue of these men who are on hunger strike. One good uh, piece of information is that the military commission that was going to uh, happen the 21st, 22nd of April has been delayed and hopefully will never happen. Hopefully there is going to be a shift in foreign policy. That's what we need. My, uh, my t-shirt underneath here, uh, done by Lori Arbeiter, says uh, the audacity of war crimes. And on the back it says foreign, U.S. foreign policy. Two sides of the same coin. Um, what we hear from the people who are speaking with speaking with people at the state house is that they don't know the constituents are behind this bill, and we need numbers. We need numbers like crazy. So I'm I don't know how many of you are in touch with Kaki, but if you could send her your email address, if you if you if she doesn't have it, and then I would have it, and we can send get your get you information about what's going on at the state house. We really need numbers. Is, are any of our, who are co-sponsors? Is, is Peter Kokut a, a co-sponsor? Peter is a co-sponsor. He Great. was for the last year. I assume he is. Ellen's story is a co-sponsor. The trouble Steve is, Kulik? Steve Kulik, they're, they're all co-sponsors, but oh, they aren't no. doing anything right. because they aren't being pushed. Okay. Yeah. So Great. they need numbers. Mm -hmm. so I, can we call, maybe I call do that something at the state house this week. Point. Yeah. I got a mile free. Oh, sure. That. Okay. Okay. okay, thanks all. Thank you. Thank you, everybody. Thank you. Thank you.